Hey beautiful people, welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Josie with Awakened Soul. If you're new here, we're here to get messages about your specific person, whoever you thought of when this video found you and you had a calling to click on it. I'm pulling their overall stance towards you, their thoughts, their feelings, any intentions they may have, and then we'll get some channeled message cards from them towards the end as well. So let's get out a few more cards. And if you're ever looking for a more in-depth look of what's going on with your connection and this person, you can head over to my channel. I have pick a card readings and pop-up readings, and um, you can head over to the playlist section if you wanna keep it easy, scroll through. Oh my, oh my goodness, you guys. <laughs> oh wow, okay, well this, <laughs> this person loves you, that's all I can say. Um, I forgot what I was saying now, cause this is going all over the place. Holy cow, you guys. This person's feelings for you are super strong and it's just like intensifying. I gotta stop pulling cards because they're just going all over the place, okay? The ones I've been able to grasp though, the Two of Cups, the Ace of Cups, the Ten of Cups, the King of Swords, Aquarius energy, and then the Lovers with Gemini energy. So holy cow, you guys, does this person love you, <laughs> okay? Um, they may have not expressed this in a deeply emotional way in the past, though, because we do have the King of Swords coming out. Maybe they've been trying to hint at it through their actions, so to speak, instead of coming straight forward and telling you with their words that they love you and care about you, um, they may have been trying to show it through their actions or when they do say it to you or try to express that to you, it's a little bit more stoic and reserved, but deep inside, my gosh, you guys, is this person like exploding with love for you? Cause that is insane. Okay. The only card we're missing right there is like the four of wands. This person would love to be in a committed relationship with you. They see you as their person for sure. Very cute, you guys. Okay. Is there a second chance? Maybe part of the reason they haven't expressed that to you completely is because you're not talking or they want a second chance to actually be able to talk about it with you. I've never met someone like you before. Mm hmm. You really impress this person like 100%. They, they look at you like their person, whether or not they've expressed it. Can we work this out? Could be a person from your past for some of you out there, or again, this, they've just been like really reserved with how they communicate with you and they're hoping to, for a second chance to be more forthright. I regret my behavior. Maybe they pushed you away in the past and they're regretting that. That could be the issue as well. I don't want to be the reason you cry. Yeah, they're sensing that they really hurt you at some point in time, maybe by not expressing their feelings. And they're wanting to come in and revamp this to a certain degree because they view you as their person. I mean, take a look, you guys. They want a second chance if you'll give them one. Whether you guys are currently talking or not, they do want a second chance to be more warm warm to you i guess i'll just say i'm like stumbling on my words right now so i'm gonna hop away you guys because your person is like ah they're chaotic they might feel like they're gonna lose you if they don't come in and talk soon so honestly i would expect communication from this person in the near future if you aren't already talking to them but i'm gonna go ahead and leave this here i hope you all have a bright and shining day and i hope to see you for a future video bye for now